from the station working for you. This is an RTV6 update. I'm Lauren Casey and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. An ugly problem now rearing its head in one county after it discontinued its recycling program, illegal dumping. RTV6 told you last month about how Johnson County had to end its recycling due to the expense and the problems with contamination. Well, now the recycling district says that this week its crews found all of this at its former dropout sites and all of this is illegal. Residents who do care about recycling say the entire issue has been frustrating. We can't keep wasting all this stuff. This is such a throwaway society. It just really upsets me that people just throw away everything. Well, back when we first did this story, the district told us that it was going to look for other options, including opening two recycling spots in the southern part of the county. Today, the district is continuing to work hard to find a solution and that you should check your with your trash hauler for recycling options and also keep checking back with the district's website for any updates. And so it begins. Gamers from all across the nation have descended upon Indianapolis this week for the longest running gaming convention in the world. Gen Con kicks off today at the Indiana Convention Center. More than 60,000 gamers are expected to attend this four day event, which runs through Sunday. Let's get a check of our seven day forecast now, Todd. And Lauren, beautiful day in progress here across the area. Lots of sunshine, low humidity, a high of 84 degrees. The temperature comes up and so does the humidity, though, throughout the course of the weekend. Heat index values will climb into the low low 90s for Saturday and Sunday with isolated storms developing especially Sunday afternoon and then continuing into early next week. Todd, thank you for more stories and weather that you need to know. You can download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.